Today I'm uh, going to talk about uh, more of God. Okay, to have more of God in our lives, uh, and we'll we'll just go ahead and see, uh, you know, how we can have more of God in our personal and in our community lives together. Our God is a great God. You know, He is infinite. He is an infinite God. So God is a great God, and because God. is a great god we can have more of him when we accept the lord jesus christ his work of redemption on the cross of calvary that's where our journey of experiencing more of him begins because you know from that moment we have become recipients of the covenant promises and blessings of god and we begin to move in those things God has designed us spirit soul and body to experience much more of him because he is infinite we can have more of god so how can we have more of god you know what are we to do to have more of god jeremiah 29 verse 13 it says and you will seek me and find me when you search for me with all your heart so god is great god is infinite we can have more of god how can we have more of god without a pursuit we must pursue god so this morning church i put down four areas where we can make this pursuit after god and experience more of him the first one to pursue the knowledge of god now without knowing who god is how can we experience more of him scriptures tell us what the nature of god is right and the way he works in our lives we understand who he really is and so understanding god in other words knowing god and this knowing is a very deep way of knowing god uh, is very very crucial to the pursuit of god if we make no effort to knowing god we cannot say that we are moving deeper with god here's the second pursuit this is the pursuit of the presence of god in our journey into the presence of god right so we don't need an earthly tabernacle now we we are in the new covenant we can move deeper into the presence of god when we move deeper into the presence of god there's only one thing that you and i can do in that most holy place to just be still because god takes over his presence takes over we can experience you know more of who he is in that holy place his overwhelming presence ministering to us transforming us changing us and releasing his power and glory into our lives the third pursuit of god which will help us have more of god is the glory of god to pursue the glory of god what is this glory that we're talking about you know glory is who god is and what he does in the life of jesus jesus manifested the glory of god through the various miracles that he did you know the wonders that he did and he even made the statement even if you don't believe me believe the works that i do because they testify they testify of who i am the glory of god now here's the last uh, pursuit that i want to talk about and this is the pursuit of personal sanctification now god releases all of him to us but there is one thing that can be a hindrance when you know um, god god has already offered himself completely and that is sin so on a daily basis when we walk together with god you know we keep short accounts and as as uh, the lord's prayer teaches us forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us you know we we come clean before god you know with a heart of repentance that is positioning ourselves for more of god 
and i want to quickly uh, also share three keys um that are important for us to experience more of god the first one is to have a strong desire the second key for us to experience more of god is focus the third one is unity these three keys will also position us to experience god in a greater measure in our lives